I now give the floor to Lydia Margosian from the Assembly of Armenians of Western Armenia. Are you in the room? Oui. Par ici. Okay. The floor is yours. Thank you, Chair. In a previous point, we set out the four areas that indigenous peoples might be placed in, namely, they might be in a situation of independence, they might have autonomous status, they might be under occupation, or they might be in uh, the process of extermination. For Western Armenia, 104 years of occupation of our land and extermination programs of our population, which are still un in place, have had a consequence, namely the disappearance of a considerable number of Armenian dialects. 104 years of occupation and mil methodological military aggression has led us to a situation of exile where we are leave li losing ways to acquire knowledge through the loss of the use of uh, the Armenian language in Western Armenia, which is a threat of extinction. Last year, we noted the blockade subject faced by 120 indigenous Armenians. We were cut off from the world for seven months. This was ethnic cleansing on the 29th of September 2023 by the Azeri Turk armed forces which uh, damaged ancestral lands of Armenians in Artsakh, speaking a distinct dialect. Therefore, return to land is crucial to preserve genetic sources from that land which exists in those territories, and also this relates to our languages. The Global Plan of Action notes mobilization of indigenous peoples themselves, of agents for change, as they can ensure the transmission of their languages through the generations. This is the principle of the right to self-determination, if which we need to consider if we want to do away with the process of extinction of indigenous languages. In applying this principle, we translated the de the UN DRIP and we adopted it in our constitution. Also, the initiative of the International Decade for Indigenous Languages is excellent and must contribute to ending this extinction through projects. What is at stake is the perennity of our humanity which is being endangered through the lack of knowledge associated to indigenous languages and this danger is all the more important if we look at the issue of knowing whether indigenous languages only represent languages to speak or do they express the necessary links to our well-being as we know humanity humanity will not subsist if indigenous peoples and languages become extinct thank you Thank you for your statements.